teachers. These would be my first. I haven't picked out of this one yet. But god damn, that one. It's gonna be a monster. Probably. Shit, I need to pick it right now. And I've been picking out of this. So I got about four huge ones drying right now. So I like to pick them. Um, uh, you see that one that just bust the cap to the, right off to the left in the middle of those three. I'm gonna go ahead and pick that. Not the other ones. Girl. Yeah, they looking nice. But I'm gonna show you the tents. So this one was the Northern Lights Auto. So I was debating on buying, uh, the buying. I was debating on buying, what was it? The Apogee power meter, but it was for the extended um, power range. So it was like from 380 all the way up to 1040. And I just bought what are the, um, the rapid LED puck 730 NM nanometers um, far red light so it was only $29 plus the accessories they didn't give you anything to hang up but I saw a little um a bit video on it and he had it hanging out by some some wire or some shit some zip ties so i got this going i forgot what day it is but nothing exciting i don't know but i was i was going to buy the meter to figure out you know the car and how where where the light should be hanging <clears throat> and now somebody told me just get the lux meter and do the conversion god damn it what the fuck Video. I had to have charged all this shit. I forgot. But yeah, I wouldn't have set it up and not, you know, made a video. So I put these bitches in the um in the final pots, the 1.5s. Somebody just showed me a picture of their two gallons. They have four foot plants and two gallons of mother plants. So I'm like, so it's possible for me to get these bitches to three feet and then plow them out. Maybe I hit four feet. Um, so I opened the tent. This morning they were doing okay. Opened the tent. And then I saw the leaves curling down. So for this one, I went ahead and tightened it up. The blue mat. And then for the cheese back here, it looks as if that's the same issue. So those leaves were curling up. That shit look fucked up. That, the cheese, and this goddamn super skunk. I don't know what's going on with that. I'm not breathing, so I'm gonna go ahead and, and keep them. I'm not about to pull the feminized plant. I'm gonna see if they're doing flower. If they give me any issues in flower, then I'm cutting them. As of right now, they could. Um, yeah, that's about it. It, it's, I seem to be saving more than I'm not. I gotta be, because I got freaking some plants in here. And I probably put, shit, I don't know, three, like, almost gallon buckets, the little, uh, not buckets, but they're almost gallons. And I put three of those in there to fill it back up. 
but who knows? I forgot how long it's been running. Maybe it hasn't been running. Maybe it's been running a week. I don't, I don't know. But it's at this pan now. I got the um, C clamp up here. Just they need to make a better system, a better a better way for it to hold on to this pole. So I got this to extend it out a little bit, clipped it on, and I didn't want them blowing directly on the plant, so I put it on high mode and got them blowing on the wall. And it dispersed like that, especially when you know, it was closed, so that's good. And I was debating on uh, tightening up the water on that. I'm not, yeah. That's a little update. Fed them um, some recharge this morning. Uh, yeah, I believe last week, it, this has been a week since they've been in here. I only fed them three gallons, so. Shit, is that saving? Well, I, it gotta be, because I'm not having any runoff with this. So, when I fed them the recharge this morning, I don't know if I'm having burnt tips from the soil now or if it's still bouncing back from, it still need time to bounce back from, you know, the fungus gnats. Uh, like the new growth, I'm seeing the shit on the new growth. That's why it might be the soil. Oh no, this is a beautiful plant. Girl Scout cookies. Um, blueberry looking nice. The Massa Kush looking nice. Maybe they just need to not be watered as much. Cheese. I don't know. I gotta. That's why I need to grow my plants out. That was an auto steel, but um, I was a little stressed training it, so I was holding it down, trying to get these other ones to shoot up. And now I'm seeing that it's not really. Well, this was larger than my. I mean, taller than my last auto. My cheese wasn't this tall, and it was in a two gallon pot. So this is 1.5. Of course, the the sour that I had fucked that shit up in the beginning, so I was highly stressed. <laughs> so it was, it could have been way better than what it was. This is a lot better. I transplanted it, but it's, it didn't it suffer no shock at all. So that was good because I really fucked that up. <laughs> but I got lucky with that. It stuck around and. Man, this bitch needs to start cranking out buds because it's been flowering for a week now. Let me look at this and try to guess this. So I got all this shit and this fucking. Uh, So the Northern Lights will be a week tomorrow. Oh, no, 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 no. The Northern Lights popped up. I planted it a week from tomorrow, but it'll, it came up on Monday, so it'll be a week on the 9th. What? Mm. I threw that top from the sour, I threw that shit away. Everyone created no roots, but I kept the dirt. Where the fuck? What am I even looking for? <laughs> fuck. I always smoke it before I do this shit. Oh. oh, the cheese when it started flowering. The 24th of February. So that was a week and three days ago. So we count Mondays. Yeah, definitely count Mondays. 
So that's not bad. <laughs> we are, we are seeing during week three or four if I don't get caught up with everybody else. Cause this shit is ridiculous. I need I need a quarter pound. If I can. Maybe not from this, but I need quarter pounds from all of these. All of these. You're not getting flowered out until you up here by this month. Three feet. You're gonna stretch them out. That's probably more than, maybe not that high, because they gotta stretch. Light's gonna be cranked up high and maxed out. I have to get the um, the Lux meter, do the conversions, like I said, make sure the canopy is even, because who knows if this shit even is even now. I got it. These aren't even cranked up all the way. Um, I've been cranking them up every three, four days or so. And I just got the 100 low because of, you know, the cheese is stretching and it doesn't seem to be st st uh, stressing it out, so. And I'll raise it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll raise it now. Even it out, man. These goddamn lights are overlapping. This damn 100 is too damn wide. And then again, they give you a lot of light coverage, so. Maybe I'm complaining about the wrong shit. Maybe. No, 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 no. That ain't smart. I was about to say, put it on. God damn it. That don't even matter. If it's a 3x3, three three, it don't matter what side I put it on. It's all going to be the same. So, that solves that. Uh, yeah, the quick video, I just want to show that they're still alive. Seem to be bouncing back from the fungus mats. If I get this watering system down. I ho hopefully it's just, you know, some strains are thirstier than other strains. So, this is simple fix, cut it back. And, you see in a week that they did, so. Mm. Um, I need another fucking tank, bro. I <laughs> need about five tanks. God damn, that's too much. This shit, see? Tips burning down there, but then up here. Like, what's going on? Like, this is living soil. I did amend it before I, you know, planted this shit, transplanted them. Maybe I shouldn't have done that because it is already amended with hella shit. Or so they say. I don't fucking know. It can be, who knows how much they put in there. So I put a little bit of my shit in there. And <laughs> now, I done probably fucked it up. The sour. I remember over the summer when I transplanted the, my little ones into a seven gallon and they were really light green. They bounced back really quick. Uh, this plant is a lot bigger than those, but hopefully that bounce back, darkens up with the nitrogen that's in there. And the next tea that I give them, I don't know if it'll be this week. I might skip a week, go next week, give them a tea. Um, but it'll be high in nitrogen and I might skip the fucking what is it? Auto trees. On that watering. It's watering and some uh, recharge. Oh damn, they said stop the recharge. Well no, it's only week one of flowers, so that's good. They said stop stop the recharge like week two, week three. Maybe even week four, I don't fucking know. But I'll stop, you know, week, week two, week three. The other ones that keep getting it. Yeah, this shit. I was trying to see if it branched out on its own, but it didn't. I was trying to see if it topped itself, but it didn't. This is really competing with the, whatever the name, what it's just called, the scientific name for it. But that's it for this video. Yeah, it's looking nice, looking nice.